In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a Facebook video ad. I will specifically show you how to create a Facebook video ad in Canva. Now before we dive into this video, let's take a look at what we will get by the end of this video. Awesome, right? So if you want to learn how to make this beautiful Facebook video ad, keep watching. So to create my video ad, I need to sign into my Canva account. Having signed into Canva, I go over to search and I search for Facebook video. Hit enter. In here, I have a bunch of templates that I can use for my Facebook video ad, but I'm not going to use any of this. You can go ahead and filter by style team and then price so if you want to use free ones you can go ahead and select free but i'm not going to use any of these templates i'm going to go ahead and create a blank facebook video so i click here and it will open in a new tab next i'm going to choose a background image so i go over to photos and i can choose from any of these images or i can go to background and i can go ahead and use any of this background just by clicking and my background will be inserted but i'm not going to use this so i take it off in order to have a unique design i'll go ahead and upload my own photo so i go over to uploads in here i can click on upload media and have my image uploaded but i already have the image i want to use as my background so i'll just click on it and drag it in here perfect next thing i'm going to do is go ahead and add my product and i have my product right here i just click on it to insert it I can take it up a bit and I'm going to go ahead and give it a little bit of rotation just like this. Make sure it is in the middle. Perfect. Next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and add some text. So I click on text right here and I'm going to go ahead and add a heading and it will appear on my canvas. Defaultly, when you try to add a heading, the text will be black and I'm having it on a black background. So what I'm going to do is I highlight all. And I first of all change the color to white. That is the color I'm going to use. Then I'll go ahead and enter my text. The new sports watch for men. And I'll open up my text box. I go ahead and decrease the size. So I select all. Then I reduce the size from here. I want to have it in two lines. I think 50 is cool. I click aside and I can position it very well. So if I don't want to use my mouse to position, I can go over to position and I click on center. Perfect. And now my first page is done. The next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and duplicate my page. So I just right click on it and I click on duplicate page. So I make sure the second page is selected. Then I'll go ahead and edit this text. So I just select all. Then I'm going to enter some features of the watch. So I'll say it is waterproof. Perfect. Maybe I'll take it down a little bit and make sure it is centered. Next, I go ahead and duplicate the second page for my next feature. So I right click on it then I choose duplicate page and make sure the third page is selected. Then I change this to stainless. I duplicate the page again and I change stainless to durable. Now I have four pages and I'm going to go ahead and duplicate for the last time. So this time around I don't need this so I select it and I delete it. I go back to the first page and I'm going to go ahead and copy this. So I just select it, Control plus C on the keyboard then I come here, Control plus V on the keyboard to paste. Perfect. What I'm going to do is, I take off the new, I don't need it. Then I'm going to go ahead and duplicate this text. So I click aside, then I select it again. Then I press Ctrl plus G on the keyboard to have a duplicate. Then I make sure it is centered. Then I'll change the text. Up to 65% off. Finally, I duplicate this text. For the last time, 
control plus D and I'll make sure it is centered and I'll change it our regular price choose brand and style I go ahead and reduce the size of the text so I just select all now go over to font size right here I go ahead and enter 20 hit enter or maybe I increase it to 25 I think 25 is cool the next thing I'm going to do is go ahead and change the font to my percentage discount so I select it and I go over to font now I'm going to go ahead and choose exa semi bold I will make it bold by clicking on bold command next I'm going to change the text color to match the color of my watch so I go over to text color and under photo colors you see that I have my watch here and these are the various colors I can get from the watch so I just go ahead and choose this perfect so my design is done I can go ahead and play it okay you see that this is boring so i close it from here and i'm going to go ahead and add some transition first of all i select the first page then i click on animate now when you select the entire page and click on animate you see that you have page animations meaning whatever animation you apply will affect the entire page so if i point on rise pan fade i also have brief and some of them are in the pro version of canva so these ones i won't be able to use it unless i have the pro version of canva which i don't have so for the first slide i'll go ahead and choose rice awesome next i go to the second page and this time around i'm not going to apply to the entire page i'll only apply to the text so i select the text and you see that i have text animations so for this i'm going to choose bounce perfect and I'll go to the third page I'll select the text and I'll choose pan for this I go to the next one I'll select the text and I'm going to go ahead and use shift the last page I'll apply to the entire page so this time around I'll go ahead and use tumble so now if I play it awesome perfect and you see that the number of seconds it will take to get to the next slide is too much so i have to reduce it take note your class will not be able to bench watch your ads so you have to keep it as short as possible so for the first slide i select it and i can go up here and change the timing so i just click on it maybe i'll make it two seconds hit enter and i select the next one so this one I don't have much text here so I can make it maybe 1.5 hit enter and I'll do the same thing for the rest of the two here and the last page I want my clients to be able to see the discount clearly so I think 5 seconds is cool one thing I can also do is go ahead and add some audio so I go over to audio right here then in here I can go ahead and use any of these free sounds I'll go ahead and play this and see how it will sound okay let me try advertising okay I think this is cool so I just drag it and drop it right here stop it see that my audio does not span across my video so I can just click on it and I can open it up to this stage perfect so now if I play So I close it up from here but I see that the beginning and the end of the audio is not cool so you may want to have your audio properly structured before you can upload it to Canva for now I'll go ahead and use this 
now my video art is done the last thing i'm going to do is go ahead and download it from here and it will be saved as an mp4 file and i'll go ahead and download all five pages so i click on download and it is downloading right here now my video is finally downloaded i can open it up to see how it will come up perfect wow this is great i exit from here so with this you can go ahead and post it to facebook to kick the ass of your competitors so that's it on how to create a facebook video ad i hope this video was helpful if you found value kindly hit the like button subscribe and also enable the notification bell so that you miss out on future videos keep watching and i'll see you in the next one